That's the small one. Red with yellow dots? Not. That's it. That's it. I can't even say it. <laughs> There's a bounty. All right, we'll get him. Welcome back to you. And me, Lord Gaming. I'm back with another Monopoly Month episode. This is Monopoly Star Wars Bubba Fett edition. There's some credits that we have to acquire, so we have Monopoly. Um, Bubba this Fett. is another one of those Monopolies that is two to four players. Mm -hmm. Instead of the traditional two to eight. You can make Bubba Fett two to eight? What the heck? Interesting. Okay, I've just seen that, and so I brought it up. Sorry. Like the box art. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Ship down here, Jabba's Palace, and the Sarlacc Pit. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Let's take a look at it. Let's get into it. So first and foremost, back to the box. The green and the sand color. Yeah. It's very like a uh, comic strip look. Yeah, very oh, pastel watered color. Yeah. Painting. Okay. We have cards, property deeds, property and deeds. community chest, and the community chest and the chance cards, as they're called traditionally. I don't know what they're called in this game yet. Do that pursuit craft. So you got the pursuit craft cards in gray with the ship. What do I do? Uh, I was noticing that the uh, Monopoly went back to the cardboard pieces. I hate them. those. And then Boba Fett helmet on there. Bounty Hunter. Oh, Bounty Hunter and then the Craft. Bounty Hunter and then the Pursuit Craft. Got to get that term right. Pursuit Craft. Alright, some bases. Yep. Which There's means four we got different, cardboard. Uh, how could, you, how could you do that to Boba? You couldn't give Boba metal pieces. I'm offended. I and, love and Boba. It's, it's even worse. It's only one-sided. And it's one-sided. To make things worse, we'll top it off with nothing uh, on the back. At least do double-sided on that in <laughs> case you get your, your piece turned around. Yeah, you're like if you're like this on that side of the board, what the heck? Double-side double them. Okay, so we got red, yellow, oh. blue, green, all in different poses of Boba. This is not looking good for Boba Fett Monopoly. Jetpack and flamethrower. Just like a nice guarding pose. Walking like he's about to get into battle. And then also just the same guarding pose like that. Alright, I wish you could have gave him his different poses and metal. That would have been nice. Okay. Yeah. So there it is on the base. Because if this is like a full Monopoly where there's, it doesn't like end early, like everything's bought and things, if it's a full Monopoly, it's going to get annoying playing with these. It's going to be annoying with those. So it's got to be some kind of catch to it. Because not many Monopolies have uh, an extra baggie with different kind of coins in it. Yeah, so. and then this might cause some issue knocking over. Oh, yeah. Yep. Oh no! So whoever's green is gonna have a fun time doing that for eight hours. Oh gosh, the extra cardboard sticking out is an extra weight, and it's just gonna keep pulling. We're gonna have over. fun doing that. Yeah. Money. So at least we got oh. money. There you go. Yeah, there's money. So Which 
proper Star Wars terms, credits. We got the skull logo with some code down here. Cool, cool. There's the ones. Five, same logo on all of them. Same design. Tens. Funny. Five hundred could have had his helmet on it. Switch it up on the five hundred. Yeah, they could have had something a little bit different on that. Yeah. So that's another little learning curve for us. This has coins in it. I don't know if that's mm. supposed to be. Are these houses and hotels? Traditional houses and uh, hotels or, or what? Those are cardboard know. too. Wait, 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 wait. Could have been like Java's Palace as the hotel. I have a brilliant idea. Let's make a Monopoly Star Wars bubble fat and we'll go cheap with you it. You could have done him justice. He's been in that pit for a while. How do you? <sighs> Don't go cheap. The instructions, well, at least they're colored with their paper. They're not laminated like some of the instructions are, so. Color is a plus, but no I, lamination. I'm kind of disappointed. I want an updated edition on this. I'm, I'm already disappointed. I want this. an updated edition. Hashtag justice for Boba Fett. So hopefully, like, the sales and all this did good to have it rethemed and have it metal. Yeah. Metal on the plastic. There's the instructions. It's colored, but it's not laminated. It's paper. So if you accidentally spill your drink on your game table or either. whatever, or at your kitchen table or dining table at home, at least yeah, it's you're colored. definitely going to have a ruined uh, instructions. At least it's colored and not black and white. It like is some colored. Of I'll give it that. But that's what I look at when it comes to instructions. Like, is it, you know. There goes Bo. But yeah, see, he yeah, fainted he, at looked at his own game. He's even like, what the heck is this? That's my game. This is what I get. He fainted at <laughs> his own game. We have a white envelope here. What's that doggy bag right there? I don't know. Food it's bag. A whole bunch of uh, pin numbers and made in China. Black figures. What the heck? That is the weirdest packaging I've ever seen for dice. Usually you would see the translucent plastic bag. That's the green small and red with yellow dots. That's, Not. That's <laughs> it. That's it. I can't even say it. <laughs> Not in this food oh. bag. What can you not say? Hasbro, what the heck happened? Did you grow out of a hole and decide to go cheap on your game? The dice is probably the this coolest is part. Pitiful. The dice is probably the coolest part of this game. With the the coloring there, they are small though. This is this is the highlight right here. <laughs> Just the dice. Why? I love both. The things. highlight to me is the box art. That's it. I love both everything things. else. Ugh. What is this? A tray. Alright, insert. All the different trays and inserts. Well, you couldn't say yellow? Okay, so. The pop out for everything. The pop out. For the cards and the four moving pieces. Okay, here's the board. <sighs> I'm ready to see what Don't this is going to Don't tell me. Did they cut down the board as well? Don't tell me. Or do we actually have full... I'm majorly board. disappointed with this already. The board is ten times smaller than okay, so already. Okay, so they, they cut out... They already property. did it, yes. It's, it's cut back. Like... So, now, yeah, so now it's going to be two property oh, set. Gosh. Yeah, it's going to be a slimmed down version of yeah, it all. I like the I like the board, though. That's cool. It's now that's cool. cool. Okay, so that's a, that's cool. The pictures. They took all their budget on the board and yeah. forgot everything else. It's I like the coloring. Look, oh wow! Look at these. Look Spinning at it around to all sides. That's Darth nice. Vader and Luke. That's cool. The pictures there. Why is Darth Vader four hundred and Luke Skywalker three fifty? Normal prices for board walking. Grogu's on here with Mandalorian. Grogu. What? So it's everybody he encountered. Oh. Bruh. <laughs> you did not. 
<laughs> you did not. You just did him dirty like that. What? Oh, they really put Mace Windu with Django. Oh, oh, you did him dirty. I was going on a boy. I didn't even notice that. That's just wrong. Okay, see, this makes sense. Jabba, Jabba the Hutt and Ben Fortuna. Okay, dang, that, that makes sense. As bro, okay, Lando Calrissian with Princess Leia in the the dang the bush uh, costume. And the the bounty hunters on here are the first two, the only bounty hunters. Well, then you got Mando Boss over there. IG-88, but... yeah. You got Mando over here. And Django. And then Django over here. But that's it. Well, well you got... Uh, A game about bounty hunters and you have... Yeah, Bo-Katan right there. But, again... Specifically yeah. Han Solo and Carbonite. <laughs> Not Han Solo. Yeah, it's Chewie. not Han Solo. It's, it's him in Carbonite. Carbonite. Okay. The Chewbacca. Makes sense in the Boba Fett game. That's cool. I like this. The board's nice. So, so these are... Railroads. So the railroads, which is... Which looks equi- like... Equipment. Uh, equipment? Jetpack, flamethrower, grappling hook, and blaster rifle. See, that could have been pieces right there. That could have been the tokens. In Monopoly fashion... Having like items instead of people, oh, yeah, these could have been and instead of the same character. Yeah, but there's the value. Are is this supposed to be like? This is based off a series, isn't it? No, it's not because Mace has been doing Chewbacca and Han Solo and Carmen. Oh, the Boba series. I mean, it, it came out for that, but it's just everything the characters yeah been around. Yeah, to do with the character itself. The original the trilogy, the you know, it's got we everything. Have sail barge escape. You pay a hundred dollars for that, or hundred credits for that, and then the state. Sort of like pit. There it Sorlac is. Sort of like pit. It's two hundred dollars. Uh, there it is. Wondering if that was gonna be on there. So then, utilities are Imperial Force. You got stormtroopers and dark troopers. Oh. Or as utilities. So I like the idea of this game. It's everything. I, I, I get it, but in. it's again, it's a slim back version of it. It's not a full scale. Everything he's been involved in. Game board. And I would definitely like to see this revised. Please definitely. Come, please come back out. That's with already. It. Oh, that's definitely. That's already bugging me because he's put the piece down there, and it's facing away from me, and all I see is a silhouette of what could be a double side. I mean, is the skull there's no telling who that logo. is. We'll look on the back side of it. Because, like, the board's great. I would like to see this come out and have the metal pieces. Yeah. Uh, Hasbro Gaming, Parker Brothers. I mean, and it's... They prove that they can still have color and also still do metal pieces because the unicorns versus llamas were metal, but they were still colored. So they can yeah. still do that with yeah. fit here. I mean, so dice are cool. That's the best, best part. Along with the boom. I just, I don't know. Oh, you can't even fit four of these on the space. No, one. you can't. One takes up all of them. So, I guess you're supposed to stack them up to four, and then. So. And then if that's they it? if they were standing up, like plastic with the logo on it, then they would have. So, I would have liked to see this revised. It definitely would have got a There it is. You know, they could have taken, and like, instead of here, you know, like, a, here, a, 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 that's okay. I mean, I've... Yeah, they've done that before. Yeah, that's not a big deal. But traditionally... <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, they could have made plastic pieces that look like an armory and uh, whatever, you know, that, that those are... Yeah. So I mean they could have had little pieces like that like they had in the past, you know, in other Monopoly games. I, I don't know, I'm just this is kind of a disappointment in my opinion. Well the Star Wars theme though. Especially Boba. The Boba. theme is is really cool, but a lot of aspects to to it is kind of a letdown in my opinion. Um Even though, like, the Boba Fett series, like, kind of ruined him a bit, 
Um, and now the game has. Boba Fett's more. nice. I love Boba Fett. And I would more. like. I would love to see him have justice as a full Monopoly game. It definitely would have got a five. Yeah, I definitely would have got a five had everything, all the components worked together. And Especially well. Boba Fett. It, would, it probably would have been a biased one there, five out of five. Uh, but I can't even be biased with this version of it. Like, I mean, I like Boba Fett and everything, but there's not enough bias in me that will you know, <laughs> make it five. I still have a there's little so bit. There's so many aspects of this that's like lower than the, the points from, from five. All the way down like the three year. I want to give it. I want to give it a three, but Boba Fett four. Okay, let's review here. Board is awesome. I love the pieces, or not the not the pieces, the pictures. Yeah, they're very colorful and they pop out. So they did really great on the board. Um, if they could have thought of something to add the third property into the sets, would have been nice. I don't like the, the cutouts here because this seems like it's a full Monopoly. A bankrupt edition of Monopoly. So playing with those for a long time. Pretty bad. Uh, and then also cardboard Monopoly. Cardboard houses and hotels. Don't like that. Yeah, so... Especially when they can't even fit four of them on there. Because this is also... Smaller. So there we go. Here's a review. The board's good. The card art is really cool. The dice, uh, in my opinion, they're, they're kind of meh. Um, Man, dice are, dice are great. Uh, if they were, opinion, if they were bigger, um, would have been better. The pieces, I could have lived with if they were double sided. They're not, so that kind of really lowers the, the whole thing there. Cardboard pe uh, hotels and houses, that's even worse, in my opinion. Like, they could have at least did something different than that. There's not much space on here. They didn't think that through when it comes to those. Um... The, you know, the instructions are color, but there's paper, so that, that's even kind of a letdown. Uh, if I had to give it one, I'd probably give it, with bias, a three and a half, at most. Three. Because, <laughs> giving it a three. Because. Because they're just, they're the. It's just, it's, it, it's a major letdown. The cutouts plus the hotels is what makes it worse. Yeah, it's... If we had plastic, then it could have been a four, but no, no. Dice... If, if, these were, if these were pieces and not cardboard, it would have definitely made the game experience better. If these were double-sided... If, yeah, if you're going to do game, cardboard, at least make them double -sided. It'll make it... It'll make the game fight better. Uh, because you're sitting you're moving around, you can't even see who that is. And, and it's so big. The backside. And it's, it's such so a tall ginormous piece. Compared to what a metal token would have been. A green blob with a thing sticking out of it now. Especially when you have people passing you and landing on the same space as you. Well, you can't stand in that space then because he's bigger than the space itself. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> like, I mean, you can't even... Oh my gosh. Wow. Dice would have been better if they were like traditional size, because that color, the red, the red and green with the yellow is perfect Boba Fett colors. But the tr it traditional is, size. it is Boba Fett color, and the, 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 I don't know if it's the yellow, the color of the yellow. It should have been maybe a little bit lighter than what it is on the dice, because those colors. Are not working together like it is on Boba Fett. Cause it's not like the colors are all over the place. You got his costume is mainly green with highlights of red and yellow. And we have a one dice is completely green with yellow. One dice is completely red with yellow, and 
it could have been where it could have been highlights of each color on both, and it would have been... White dice with, like, streaks of <laughs> red and green on them. Something to, you know... Uh, but I like that. But I like, I like the dice, like, uh, the, the color they got going on here. I see what they're doing with it, but still, it's just... They made the dice comfortable, because uh, it's rounded off corners, but they're, like, miniature... Uh, dice. If you have big hands, they feel really small. And I'm just gonna. I'm, I'm looking at this. I'm thinking. I'm trying to think about this. Okay, with an open mind, they did all this with the game. And I'm looking at the age that it's geared towards. And it's eight and up. And I'm like, seriously, <laughs> this looks like a game. As far as the pieces and the dice is concerned and everything, this looks like a game that is made for a child. Grogu? <laughs> Grogu size. Based on... The way that, the, how small the dice is, yeah. But I mean, yeah. Just... The, the way everything is modeled, it's like... Maybe uh, we, maybe it's geared towards a younger audience, and, and I look at the box, and it says 8 and up, and I'm like, no, that's traditional age. For Monopoly, that, so... It should have been the traditional size dice. And it should have been traditional... Really, I didn't even know it was 8 plus. I mean, really, it should be like 12 or 13 plus. But... Yeah. So... Again, they made it... Kiddish. You know, All right, so... Hasbro, final that's message. That's probably what it is. Because... Making it really... bad. There's instances where I know you watch the channel... I have theories, uh, so please come back out with this and. What what's going it. on? Like, we we play Monopoly almost religiously, and we get this game, and we're excited to open it. We open it, and it's like, <gasps> oh, thank yes. Um, like if this is a full Monopoly, <coughs> I'm 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 switching out the pieces. I haven't read the instructions. I'm switching based on this. It's got to have some extra rules or something because the board is condensed down. It's only two properties it per property Because I would set. like to play a traditional. Because yeah. I always like playing a traditional. So hopefully they don't change it. But yeah. um, I'm halfway through. not Probably not even halfway through. I'll probably do that for the like, first five turns so you guys can see it. But I'm switching to the pieces that came in the Saga edition that we did for the May 4th thing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean... Uh... Just so you can see the difference between these pieces and the, what's supposed to be out of Monopoly game. Yeah, like definitely. Vader it's... and Luke or something play as them for this. So, yeah, it's it's kind of disappointing, but... There you go. It is what it is. Uh, Monopoly, Star Wars, Boba Fett Edition. Basically the past ten minutes of us just... <sighs> Bashing. <laughs> it's not really bashing. It's just like we know how yeah, ranting, ranting the game. There you go. Parker Brothers can do better, and mm -hmm. it's kind of a letdown, you know. So now that you enjoyed the past ten minutes of ranting the game, it's just a rant, rant <laughs> over, I guess. What are you gonna call it? But Still not happy, but you know, it's Boba Fett. Not, so not happy. That boosts it. Disappointed, maybe, but you know, I mean, don't forget to like. Comments. Tell us what your thoughts are on this mm -hmm. one. Really, give us your your opinion on this. Are we off base or are we right on target on our on our oh, right on target rating and everything? You know, like I want to know what their opinion. Or are you thinking, is. guys, you're, you're stupid. It's just a game. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> tell us what we're thinking. Tell us what you think about. It. Are we, are we, you know, overreacting about this or are we just? I just love Boba Fett and I would like to see him get his normal game because I know you can do better. Hasbro. I do too. And it, it, you know, it was just, it wasn't like one disappointment. It was like disappointment on top of disappointment on top of disappointment. It's like, come on, side would have helped it a bit. Parker Brothers, come on, you can do better than this. But, but they, anyway, there you go. Anyway, uh, yeah, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I know I said that already. Hit the bell. Follow us on Twitch, you underscore me game. You can yeah. chat, interact with us, and be featured in the YouTube videos. And we put on the viewer board and the leaderboard.
two year anniversary coming up. New set backdrop coming soon. I'm just oh my gosh. Join on Twitch early access to the two year anniversary. And shout out to Kane for being number one on the leaderboard, Woo! which is rubbed off, and now it's the leader witch board. Sorry, you guys aren't witches. <laughs> the leader witch board. Um, it's Halloween now, the leader witch board. Apparently, the, the board is still in Halloween mode. Witch uh, board. Yeah. Well, there you go. Stay tuned for the full playthrough of Boba Fett Monopoly. And more episodes of Monopoly Month. Check out last episode. Check out last year's if you missed it. See ya. See you all in the next one. Bye-bye. What's your favorite property on this? Leave it down in the comments. I'm, I know a lot of people are going to say, Grogu! Obviously, that's a given. Yeah, it's probably obvious which one there, but... Come on, out of all these people. <laughs> I mean, I like a lot of them, but... We'll see what they say.